Sammy, another knockout game, another local derby, another man of the match performance. Yeah, um, for a person that's not really battered in the tournament and to win a game for your uh, county is is massive for me and that's something that I really pride myself on, to be honest. Um, and obviously winning and getting to finals is very special, great day uh, for, my, for, the cert, for myself and, and the club and, the, and our boys, so yeah, really good. We could hear, especially because of the, the empty ground room, you could hear your celebrations sort of echo around the ground at the last moment. What were your emotions like during that whole last over, really? Well, going into that last over, needing 13 rather than 17 was a big, big help for me. Um, but yeah, I, know what, I always pride myself on backing myself um, to the last ball, trying to hit sixes, fours to win the game. Yeah, I, that kind of, that's why I play cricket, uh, to win games. And yeah, it was, it was a great feeling, especially beat Leicester, fine. It was like a derby, it was brilliant. Yeah, how much does it mean for someone with a 15, 20 year association with a club to be that man again, to take knots over the line? It's always, it's always good to beat Leicester. Um, and yeah, to be that man to win the game, I, as I said, I pride myself on that. Um, and yeah, really, really happy. It's a good day. Did you know the situation out there off the final ball, what yeah. you needed? Well, I, we asked the umpires, so two off the last we knew we'd get us home. And what was your attitude going in, uh, was it 99 for 6 when you approached the crease? What was your mentality going into the knock? Do, do what we can. Um, the boys that had a go before tried, and me and Maul always try and back ourselves to be there at the end. And Unfortunately, Maul got out, but hey, I was one, one man to, to be there at the end, which I try and pride myself on. And a word on the bowling attack as well, particularly in those power play overs, yourself, the likes of Imad Wazim as well, keeping that power play score down ended up being very crucial. Really. Absolutely, yeah. Imad, high class operator, Jake bowling really well, Dan Christian. Uh, we've got a good bowling attack. Um, Matt Carter only bowled one over today, but I'm sure that will change on finals day when teams have left handers and stuff. So we're, we're pretty adaptable like that, and, and yeah, we're pretty good. And what do you do now? 24 hours, a little bit more until uh, till the semi finals are scheduled to get underway? Yeah, a bit of rest. Um, travel down, I think, on Saturday morning to, to Edgerston because I think we've got those second semi, if I'm right. Um, and yeah, hopefully, we'll be celebrations. And does it give you a, a bit of a confidence boost winning in that kind of fashion tonight? Absolutely. Getting over in a scrappy game gives the team a lot of confidence, to be honest. And I know we, we pride ourselves on getting the runs before that um, and knocking them off. Um, however we do is, is very good but yeah now most of the guys have had bat um, and we're pretty confident